Hello, hope you are doing well. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Would you please make sure to subscribe and hit that bell button for more elephant videos. Today we're going to see how the treatment is done for a severely infected elephant. According to the report, the elephant has found in the middle of the jungle after falling sick from a villager. When it got reported to the Wildlife Conservation Authority, also few times have been passed. The elephant has been infected with a severe anal wound. Due to that severe infection, he has fallen into the mud pit. Since the animal is in a mud pit, he is covered in mud and the animal is severely weakened. It is needed to boost up the elephant first. So they're giving saline treatment to the elephant. The needle is connected to the ear as the arteries are closely visible in the ear and blood supply is high in the ear. So that is helpful to administer saline and other medicine rapidly to the bloodstream. The elephant is not completely unconscious. We can see him struggling too as he feels the injections in his ear. The saline, multivitamins, antibiotics are usually given for these types of infected animals for an easy recovery from the infection. The infection at the anus is clearly visible here. The cause for the infection can be anything as these animals live in the jungle and get exposed to many bacteria, fungi, and insects constantly. Such infections can really cause some serious damage for the lives of the animals too if they were not administered with the medication on time. According to the reports, this animal has given treatments for two days straight as the infection has spread throughout the whole body. The animal has been there for a while as it is just middle of the forest. That is why the officers are giving him saline to recover the dehydration caused due to lack of food and water. Usually for an elephant, 10 to 12 bottles of saline are administered. The multivitamins and antibiotics are added to the same bottle of saline so that the piercing for the animal is minimal. <laughs> this is a bit risky too since the animal is conscious. Officers have lost their lives in earlier instances while treating such animals. 
The animal is unaware and he is already in pain, so there's a good chance for the animal to attack the people around. Remember, animals in this state are never given sedatives. Only strong elephants who have minor infections are given with them. It's a full process with a larger number of human interventions. These are surgical matters, which should be conducted in a sophisticated surgical room. But since the animal is wild and with the existing facilities, the officers are doing their best to make the animal to a better condition. The wound in the anus has caused a difficulty for the animal to walk as well. That is another reason why he has fallen into this mud pit. The animal is recovering and due to the medicine, he is heavily breathing. It is reported that the animal was here for around five more days after a two-day treatment and has left the place after recovering. The animal's body mass is also very high, so he needs to have full strength to lift his body up and walk. And that's the end of our today's story. It is indeed a happy ending. Not like earlier days, now several authorities are concerned about the conservations of wildlife, which is actually a good thing to be appreciated. The officers are obviously having a hard time treating these animals, but they really enjoy it because they know how important these animals are for the ecosystems. Thank you for watching. We'll be back with more amazing stuff soon.